There we go. Now everything's set up. There we go. Now we can actually do this. Just resize the screen so that way it's not just a tiny window. Because I'm currently operating with a weird thing because of my stupid setup that is broken. And I clicked the wrong button. You should save up and invest in another monitor. The question is, what do I save up with? I, you can't save up if you don't have income in the first place. Christmas, birthday. So save up Other time holidays. Time. Save up time is what, you're at, is what you're saying. Pretty much. There we go. Yay, it's working now. I think. Good, you didn't break it this time. 720p is available, which is nice. So it's not this is very necessary. Yes, it is. Why are you running circles around me? Stop it. Why do we currently have you can't stop being me. processed and did nothing? Oh, right, because it's on this. Sorry. You're stupid. Yes, I am. I'm tired as well. Everything can be heard, correct? Uh, yeah, everything's set up. Okay, good. No more fumbling with the stream stuff. Time to actually play the game. Turrets or electronics? What? Turrets? Uh, oh. Electronics. We shouldn't have to worry about enemies for a little while. Now the only question is, what should we actually do? Mushroom wise, I'm gonna expand electronics or like the electricity production. Yeah, we need to do that. We need to up forward production of iron mainly. And we need to um, start automating things like the production of the red research packs. So we don't have to refill it with copper and iron each time. Yes. Lots of stuff. Okay, I assume you're currently watching the stream as well as not someone, like, not another person? Yeah. Okay, good. Just making sure. I always have the stream just anyway. open. Oh yeah, did you see? We're currently at 50 subscribers. Yay! I did not notice that. Our first kind of milestone. A very small one. Take what we can get. Okay, can't be picky. Fair enough. Just be grateful that we're actually making progress. We currently got a second boiler and another steam engine up. I'm gonna get, make some more though, just so we don't, so we have more time that we can not worry about it. That's always good. One thing for sure, though, coal certainly is not an issue at the moment. Oh, let me to rephrase: it is currently not an issue. It could be one later. That's why I said currently. Anything and everything will probably be an issue later. But hey, guess what? The li guess what the live stream gets gets you to lets you do. What? It lets you yell at me more about putting lights down because you know we're doing a live stream, so people we'll need to be able to see. Well, yeah, we mainly just need the lights until we can get the modular armor and get the night vision. Yeah. The night vision is very nice. Sometime we should see if, like, uh, Imperion ever, like, Im ever improved their, uh, peer-to-peer -peer system. Like, just do Steam or something like that. that if you'd like, I can check the update logs right now. 
let's just let's just focus on focus on this. Try to remind me later. Well, no, because I was gonna do. You know, I'm just waiting for more iron and stuff because uh, I want to up production so of yeah, iron and copper. Now. So it, I just want to wait for more of a surplus while, before I take half of, of it. I've not paid attention to the logs in that game for a while now, so it would probably be a uh, one that happened a while back. Just make sure I don't die. No promises. I have to adjust. Pretend to care. That's hard. I said pretend, not actually. It's still hard. I may not be the king of indifference like you, but I mean, I am still me. I and mean, there is a reason we get along so well. Because we're both assholes. God yes. damn it. No, my push the talk button will go back to the previous page on Steam and stuff like that. Uh, and on the internet, basically I can't have my mouse over anything when I talk. Ah, uh, fun. And in Factorio, it's select. And I can't change this either. You said you were waiting for copper to go up, right? Just mainly everything, because I want to put more mines and furnaces on everything. Because I'm gonna, so. just, I'm gonna do that real quick. All right, I've and then. Hold on, actually, I want to check something. Well, if you're saying hold on to this, too late. Ever, I already placed another drill. No, not that. No, because um, I wanted to look to see when we'd be able to upgrade furnaces. Mm. But we need 75 green ones, green science packs to do that. Those are difficult. Yes. Ah, I believe this is sounds like fun. And your Discord. Discord's not as big of an issue. I remember during the last stream, I would just hear it going off. I didn't hear anything that might have been yours. Nope, because mine might have a notification when I, I heard one. Or I just started disregarding it. Maybe both. Because you know, sometimes it gets to a point where you don't even notice the sound anymore. Oh, it makes me surprised that's what's happening. Yes, we did it. We did research the splitters. I'm gonna try doing an experiment for doubling up uh, furnaces. So this may work, this may fail horribly. It's probably gonna fail horribly and I'm not even seeing it right now. Instead of looking through all the change logs, I'm just gonna Google it. Because it's way too many change Just logs. Just look up Imperion peer to peer or something like that.
Alpha 6.5 co-op update. Okay. So we shall try testing that. Because I would love to be able to stream that game. Because it's fun. We're bad at it. Just like most things, but it's fun. I don't know how it works, or if it's any good, but it says the title of it is Alpha 6.5 Co-op Update, so I'll have to see. I'll go ahead and look into it. I have... I've done a thing with copper production. I'm gonna need to place more furnaces, but... Yeah, so when you start the game, you would just click the drop down menu on start and click co op server. Oh, okay. It says it works that easy. We'll have to actually check that. So, when we whether or not it actually works. Factorio, let me know what you think of the, what I did with the co copper. That's good. I found, I finally found a way to be more space efficient with production. Yay. Now the only question is, what would you, what do we do if we want to expand this another layer? We can bring it over here instead. That too. We have to cut down these trees, though. We'll have to cut down a lot of trees. This could be a lot. Of fine, we don't have to worry about this. We can literally just consistently go to the right forever. Yeah. Until we end up placing something there inevitably. We don't really need to. Or we can just make more layers anyway. Well, no, but we can go further right as well, and then yeah. down. Because yeah. we're also going to need to remember, this is our nearest uranium thing. When we start needing uranium, we're going to pretty much be using this. I know. So, we'll still only be able to move it over the, so much. We need to do steel production. Yes. I'm gonna start doing that. I will start setting up a subsection of drills for that. Just to keep it self contained. Because I prefer having it. Oh, we're gonna do a self contained one? Yeah. Okay. I just prefer doing it that way. So that way, if we need iron, we can go to one place, and if we need steel, we can go to another. Well, no, what I typically just do is take it off of this line that goes to the chest and just put it in its own chest. I just don't like cutting off uh, one thing just to make another thing, when both things are going to be useful. But it wouldn't cut off either. It Still would just split the enough. resources. Too bad, we're doing it this way. Because I've already placed a drill. Two. How many drills should we make? I'm currently making four in total. Just, we would only need two. We don't really need many. We need all of them. 
We're gonna have as much steel production as we are iron. That's not exactly what we need. But what's wrong with more steel? The fact that we also need iron. But we have iron. You act like that's actually enough. We can make more iron. This is a fairly big deposit. This means nothing. I don't see your point. Would you like me to show you my single player world? No. We will figure this out. You should know by now that I have, the way I play this game is, I find an, I do a thing, then later on I find an issue with said thing, and then I fix that issue. But, you can just do it the correct way in the first place. No. It's easier that this way. This way works for now. Yeah, for now. If we need to fix it, but, then we will. But it's easier to just do it correctly now. No. I yes. disagree. But, but I'm correct. I disagree. Because now we also have to pump coal over here. Who cares? It's just a there, down, and then right. You really just like making this difficult. He is like arguing. I mean, so do I, but still. We really need to automate these stupid conveyor belts. Hold on one sec, I'll move this. Yes, I made 10. And you were yelling at me for going overkill. It's because you need at least two per, then some extra isn't going to hurt. That's what I was to deal with all this I overflow. I didn't agree. I'm gonna start pumping coal over. I'm oh. gonna make more furnaces. Actually, I'll finish up doing this, the inserters. Could you go ahead and pump coal over? Let's not forget, we're gonna need another 10, because I plan on just making this go directly into another line of furnaces. Yes, I know. Should I just take it off the copper line? Uh, sure. Preferably the one that just has, that only has coal though. Not one that has copper and coal well, going yeah. down it and hope that everything gets processed by then. Yeah, I know. I'm gonna take it off of right here. Okay. The bottom most coal one. I see. I just have to wait for stuff to crash. We're also going to need some long inserters, and could you move, please? No, no, I was just making sure, because I set it up over here, and I was just double-checking that it wouldn't interfere with the iron. Mm, okay. Before I, you know, pumped a bunch over. Yeah. But it should be good, so I'm pumping it over now. Yeah, it's all going to be going along that side of the line. Anyways. Yeah, no, I just wanted to look over to double-check, you know, before I just... 
through it there. And it, you know, turned out that, hey, screwed up. There's coal here. I mean, not coal. Stone. One of those two words. Lost those are two there. very different words. And they're close enough. They're very different. They both have no. We need steel, like, now. I'm working on it. Could you get onto production of uh, building some long inserters? How Maybe many are we gonna no. need? Uh, hold on. Yeah, we're going to need about. Actually, hold on one sec. Let me try something and see if we can get away without having to use them. But I'm gonna refill the uh, red signs back things. We weren't producing any. Hmm. No, the reason I said that we need to get steel chests now is because we're overflowing with iron. Yeah, we're going to need these long arm, long arm inserters. We're going to need ten. They are being produced. Okay. Oh, oh yeah, right. There we go. be a lot easier if we had the medium poles, but we don't have those. We can just update it later. We're gonna need to update this later. Well, I mean, once we do it this way, we probably won't even have. To, we probably would just. It'd be better not bothering with it. I say as I get completely stuck. That one didn't even need to be there, apparently. Okay. That one, however, is directly in the way. I can't 
shit in it, but... I'm using the first bit of our steel to make a steel chest for this. There we go, it's completely set up. Hold on a second, I'm gonna go ahead and reorganize this real quick. Because doing it this way will be kind of difficult later on. If we ever need to do like the whole chest expansion thing. So I'm gonna have this go under here and then start All expansion right. over here. And I'm out of iron. I'm gonna go grab that. Yeah, but this iron deposit is going to run out really quickly. That's something you're going to have to remember. Oh yeah, because I didn't set it to having higher things. Yeah, the single me is 500,000. And there's not exactly more iron very close by. Well, I set it up pretty deliberately for that, so we're gonna have to try and focus on expansion fairly early on. Yes, but again, I don't think you realize how much iron you need to expand. Radar. Radar and turrets is what we should, we should start researching next. That way we can actually find more deposits and start setting up you know, systems to transport it. We are gonna need a lot of iron, but I mean, since we're gonna be collecting iron anyway, it should be fine. What we should do is just wait until we get laser turrets for and just power it. Cause if we do ammo, that means we'll have to regulate that automatically, and that's not really gonna be possible. Yeah. Well, I mean, we will still want to produce ammo for ourselves and the military science packs. Well, yes, but I meant like if we make drills over there and want to protect them. We're not exactly going to be able to be pump ammo over there. Yeah. Because that would be way too far, and they would just break the conveyor belts, and it wouldn't do anything then. I do see a, another uh, iron deposit to our north west. That has north west? Yeah, but again, that's fairly, that's a fair distance. I know it's a distance, but it's... One, it's the closest large one. There are right. a few. The other ones are ones smaller. They're basically useless. The smaller ones we'll still have to use just because more iron, but they won't be as useful. Like I said, I pretty much have it built. I have it. I set up the map so it would be built like this. So the expansion actually is a thing that we have to worry about because, you know, trains. I want trains to actually be useful. What I just wish you did was made the deposits rare, but a lot more resources in them. I would have preferred that. Oh well, let's just hope the devs knew what they were doing when they said normal. I'm making a steel chest for the iron. Okay. Correction, I'm making two steel chests for the iron. Good enough. Uh, 
do you want me to start to build our first radar? We might want to wait a little bit longer. Well, I mean, remember, we had a radar going for quite some time before enemies attacked, and it doesn't look like there's any nearby. I suppose. Just make one, then. No, the reason I worry is because our pollution is getting far already. Yeah. Well, I think it'll only start posing problems if, like, it actually reaches an enemy base. Well, yeah, but the second even the smallest amount touches an enemy base, they get pissed. And by pissed, I mean pissed. Then research military so we have machine, machine guns. I'm researching turrets. This is all in our queue. We will also have to worry about uh, oil processing. Which, it does appear that there is some oil just south of that large iron deposit that I was pointing out earlier. Oh yeah, there's a ton there. You know what, it says 400% yield, that's a lot. Yeah, there's another issue that occurs when it comes to the other iron thing. Pumping coal. What? Yeah. That's why I wish you did, like, deeper resources in this. Because we're going to need trains first, so we can pump coal, and then pump the iron back. We're not going to be able to do conveyors, it would so have to be trains. once this research is done, we'll research engines, so we can actually start doing the trains? I was going to do military, and then that. Okay. Uh, I'm going to start working on automation for science packs. Yeah, right now I'm just working on, I'm going to start pumping iron over. Where do you currently have that set up? The Down to the south. What is that? Southwest. You see where there's just that random line that extends ah, down yeah. towards. You should also I like research your lights. Yeah. Because yeah. you know, you finally, it's help, it's helpful to you be finally able to see. joined. See, now you understand. No, but the reason I put them there is because there's not really much in that area, so there's just a huge area for expansion for them, which we're going to need. Um... How do I want to do this? Don't worry, I, I was going to figure it out. Do you want to worry about getting iron over there, and I'll just focus on the actual factories and stuff like that? Uh, sure. You do know how to set it up, right? I've done it before. Alright. Well, I don't know, because the last time we did it, it kind of was crappy. Because you started pulling things off and started breaking it. Because it's good to make it so that you can pull things off. But no. Yes. You lie. You, I don't think you understand how difficult this gets later. I don't know why it gets difficult. I'm just saying that it's better to just not be pulling things off of something that's all that's already being produced. So I'll just slow things down. Because also copper. Copper will be easier. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and do copper. Because I have everything so tightly knit, I'm going to just make another self-contained thing. We don't need self-contained things for everything. I'm aware, but I mean, everything is so closely packed together over here, it'd be a pain to try pulling it off. It really wouldn't. Yes, it would. I, I see a very easy way you could. I don't care. I'm doing it this way. The chest is toward the top, you can just bring it over. There's underground belts for a reason. But where would I pull it off? Because the splitter here would just cause it to go directly into that. The splitter here would just kind of work properly. Up here, and you can go over. I'm not looking for coal. And no, we're not no, going to again. everything yeah. being pulled off and put into the chest. I'm doing this, and I found a way to do it. Alright. Hmm. 
My dad discovered B BMNG Drive, so that's fun. What? Nothing. I'm pretty sure you said something. I don't think a conveyor going over our very limited iron is a good thing. Well, I don't have many op options. You could have made it closer to the edge of the iron. Just make it do as close to the edge as possible, it's better that way. Yeah, it's as close to the edge as possible. I need more conveyors first. Engines or something else? Military. Military. We need to automate the green ones before we can do anything with them. Oh yeah. Forgot about that part. Well, copper set up. I threw some uh, iron plates into the chest, so it'll have to be producing something. While we're, while we're setting things up still. Why'd you get rid of the chest? Because it's already going to be stacking up here anyway, so there's no reason to have a chest. Fair enough. Though, Gwen, that means you can't branch out of it. No, we can. We can split her here. Or branch anywhere along this line. I always like to place on the conveyors before I move stuff over. Mm. So that, you know, I don't have this stuff in the way in case I need to replace things.
What are you doing? I'm trying to place another layer. So there's more being produced. No, oh, I thought we stalled on power for a second. No, I was moving a pole. That just happened to be connecting literally everything here. We're gonna need a power production soon now. Yeah. You're really struggling with this. Yes, I am. When am I not struggling? I don't know. You should know better than to have faith in me. Tier 2 is better. Yes. Why don't you start upgrading the... the Inserters then. What you should do is pump it into the chest, and not like that. You should pump it into the chest. Another chest. Or have its own, okay. So that way we can have another science thing over here as well. More science. Why are you having it go two separate ways? Because I'm bad, but it's the wrong way. You can just click R on it. But no. They're not free of logic. You should know this by now. Ignoring the fact that this is an entire game based around making logic systems. Light. Yes. So now this is done, now do you want to try working on, uh, green? One moment, I'm just I mean, making I mean, more I'm tier 2 points. is not probably the term you're looking for, but... No, I'm gonna start working on it in a second. I just need to make more of the things. They're crafting. I'm gonna have this be a couple blocks over so we can expand red more if we need. Yeah. By uh, two more. Should be room for two more. Yeah, I have this as compact as I can make it. Yeah. Unless there's I know. some other way I can do it. But this is also the most simple way.
I should have left enough room for two or three more, so so that should be good. The copper comes up here. Hmm? I thought you were pumping the copper over. I am. I was going to put it. Yeah, I'm there. explaining that it goes up here. Like all the way at the topmost one. I'm placing this down for reference. All right, I need to go get more iron. I know this part looks weird, but I'm just trying to make it as compact and stuff as possible. With it being somewhat practical. I know this is probably going to annoy you, but I think we should have green running along the bottom of this conveyor belt and blue and red running along the top because if you think about it, the inserters are going to be putting it on the other side. That way we can have them both running down the same thing fairly simply. We can do that and just have this one be on top. But you see, this, is, this line, which I have to have, is going to be interrupting this. If we ever plan this out it more, then we won't be able to then this line on to have him end up getting in the way. But why do we need that to be on top? Because you put it up there and I had to do that. I tried making this go out as long as possible so at least we could fit in this, but I can't even do that. It doesn't reach that far. No, what are you talking about? The underground belts. Pretty much this line is going to get in the way regardless of what we do. 
there's nothing I can do to get rid of this. Okay. So, we should make this running along the bottom of this. Like, down here. Why? Because otherwise everything's gonna be in the way. You do realize that we can just pr bring these and bruise them up as well. We have room that way. We don't just have to go sideways. Let's see it as you were. We, we have plenty of room here, that's why I put it down here. You should make fast inserters. Don't power this yet, please. Don't power it. I, I want to set it up first. Okay. Again, I like to set things up and see if it'll work first, and then I do stuff like that. I usually just kind of have it going until it breaks, and then that way it's a bit more obvious no. when something breaks. No. No, see, I like doing it like this and setting it up. Okay, this should work. You can power it. Nope, never mind, I'm an idiot. Fix. The one thing I'll slow down this production is iron gears. I think. They're not exactly the most difficult to produce, we can always make a second factory and dedicate for those. No, wait, hold up. Issue occurred. So apparently these can't grab this corner here. I didn't realize they couldn't do that. Oh no, wait, never mind, I can. Oh yeah, never mind, everything's good. Except... You're an idiot, that's what. That's why I was saying you need to put it on the bottom. Why did you just... What are you doing? No, stop. No, I know. I was stopping it so that it would stop throwing it in the wrong place. Temporarily. We had put it on the bottom we wouldn't have had this issue or we can literally just do what you did i don't see why you're so opposed to scrapping everything and starting over again because that would just be a lot more effort when we can just do something this simple this will be a lot more that would actually be better in the long run for once i'm actually thinking for the long run 
something wrong here. How is there something? Oh, cause you're. Because but how I'm would that be? Thinking for the long run, and you're the one not. But this wouldn't make too much of a difference in the long run. Yes, it would. If we already have to make red, then we'll be stuck because there's a giant thing in the way. Again, we can put more up here. It would still be a pain, either way. And I didn't say you had to put the copper here. You could have brought it over more to the left first, and then brought it up. Then we'll still have to expand over this way, and again, it'll get in the way. Either way, it's gonna be in the way. In the way. We're not gonna need, like, 20 red ones. Who says? You do realize that we already have... over, like, 200 already stockpiled. In this five minutes, we built this. I disagree. You can't disagree. disagree. We already have 200. I can disagree. I'm doing At it most, we're it. gonna need one or two more, and we have ex we have room for that. At most, we just might have to move the copper thing over one or two blocks, and everything would be fine. I know. I've made a huge production of these things. You're not thinking big enough. We wouldn't have the iron to sustain five of each of them. That's all pumping more. We need trains first. Those cost a lot. Then get trains. We have not green now. Now you should start building more labs to the right instead of left. I'm going to go place lights everywhere. Yeah, I'm with that. We need them. I'm aware, I'm just saying you can have fun with that. We now have four science things up. You mean labs? Yes. We need technical terms when you're going to say science thing. Because I don't know what you're talking about. You don't even know what I'm talking about. I do. No, you don't. Here's the question, do you want to know the things I'm talking about? Sometimes. Why? Because I need to know when you place random stuff. And when you make perfect. mistakes so I can go fix them. Still should've put the green things on the bottom. I would be telling chat to yell at you, but the current there's no one watching. I'm gonna be putting two more boilers and five more steam engines. Okay.
When I'm done with that, I think we're good. we should just end the stream. Alright. I'm just waiting on stuff to craft. Ah. Yeah, we are nearing max performance. I didn't make enough pipes. I know, I hate pipes. We need landfills. Yes, we do. Because I hate these random patches of water. But we also need trains. We need a lot of things. Yes, we do. Anyway, that's a good place to end the stream. Yep. Yeah, bye.